Hello my friends, this is Grant from the future welcoming you to Twitch Trolls Grant Heart of the Swarm. Twitch Trolls Grant is a now annual fundraiser used to help pay for the continued production of the StarCraft II custom campaign content that we make. Viewers pay bits to influence the game as I play through Heart of the Swarm and I have to struggle through the chaos. If you want to see a list of the events and details on how mission and planet events work, check the document in the description. Otherwise, I hope you enjoy. Let's start this up, my bros. So, we're obviously going to have to... Gosh. <laughs> it's going to be awful. By the way, guys, look at the trivia time one in the document. It is amazing. There is three different levels of trivia. Uh, Subsorian wrote over 100 trivia questions for every single difficulty. It's going to be absolutely insane. Let's do... What? We already hit the mission call. Oh, no. Everything is going to start as Goliaths. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no 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 um so i believe the stuff like we move unseen even though we can only see this much of the map it is being covered in uh like everything is being covered oh good we have 250 minerals already <laughs> thank you for the no <laughs> thank you for the destructible rocks here's some cows oh no Oh no, we're not going to be able to make our spawning point because there's rocks in the way. <laughs> yeah, okay, so the beginning is going to be interesting. How do we... We don't dodge, do we? Hmm. <laughs> okay, so things start off in a uh, very closed space. Luckily, uh, we got some minerals people gave us. And they're so... They're so... <laughs> He creep tumors and invisible cows. We got the drones going. Oh gosh, uh, what is the name of the ship where Han and Horner produce their mercenary units in co-op mission? It is an assault galleon. I don't know what I got. <laughs> oh, 10 free zerglings. <laughs> okay, cool. Um. Uh, I'm just, I'm gonna keep making drones until I harvest 300 minerals. People are going insane on the first mission. I assume... How did Matt Warner win his lovely my beer? He won her in a poker game. I know that... Oh, yeah, we got an ultra. Are you serious? Thank goodness the Solarite does reduce damage to buildings, huh? Oh, gosh. Hercules full of hercs. Whoa. Okay. Uh, be careful, guys. The game is getting close to crashing because... Please... <laughs> Please... <laughs> <laughs> I would like to get out of this. Uh, I can't spawn anything because there's too many cows. <laughs> well, here comes the soul ride again. Okay. Well, we're going to let people get it out of their system at the very beginning here, right? This is obviously a very good start. There is... There's a lot of moves. Oh. That's not a good... <laughs> Somebody is a big fan of the Solarite. So, one thing that is worth mentioning, guys, is that stuff like the Solarite one has an increasing cost over time. What that means is that... It can't be spammed. It's not like this can happen for the entire campaign. I promise. Are you serious? How many of them is he activating? <laughs> this is... How did Artanis live? <laughs> I'm gonna get a limit. I'm gonna be the world's first person to lose on Lab Rat. <laughs> well, I'm really glad that we stress tested the system during mission one. I think this is incredibly helpful <laughs> that is incredibly helpful <laughs> let's try again I'm <laughs> see if we can get this hatchery down this time oh I'm gonna <laughs> I just, I want to say thank you both to my, uh, the modders, Orca, Ace, and Violet for being so insanely power, or so insanely good. Oh no, you can't power build this one because it's a curated thing. 
All right. Um, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna throw this out here, Ace. I think that we might need to increase the cost of Wemu One Scene. <laughs> it just might be a little high right now. What was the purpose behind the creation of the art ships? What the heck is an art ship? To preserve Protoss society in case of a cataclysm, for Conclave to escape should the Iron Fall, usher in a new era, cut short by Adun's death, prepare for eventual return of the Zelnaga. That seems like cataclysm. Yeah, okay. Um. Yeah, Ace. <laughs> How about that? How about that Wemu Unseen cost? It might be a little bit low. Luckily, Vorzun can kill the cows. Oh, this is absorbing difficulty. What is the name of the dig site Rainer attacks in Wings of Liberty mission, The Outlaws? Uh, Metis dig site, Firebase, White Rock, Rickfield Station. Everything is a station there, right? No, I think it's a Metis dig site, right? It's I like it didn't even read the books. <laughs> I got a Herc for all of Hercules, at least. And we're being solarly bombarded. Which is killing all the stuff. I Okay, the cows are mostly dealt with. However, however, I don't have any money. And I have no drones. Um, <laughs> can we... Oh, I have one drone. We can send it to mine. Uh... Oh, I have another drone. I don't know where this came from. Hey, thank you for the minerals. Oh, I don't have... I have 18 supply. Okay. This is too many cows. This is actually a lot of cows. Well, all the drones are going to die. Hopefully I lose all my supply. Though. Let me... I, I can't even control these guys because they're just gyrating because of the cows. Um. Uh, I can't make any drones because I'm supply blocked. And I don't have the ability to make an overlord because it's the first mission. This is quite the testing chamber. Every... Th I think I'm soft locked until I can kill off my guys and I can't... I literally can Oh, here we go. Wait, their AoE kills cows? See, it's trying to spawn stuff, but there's too many cow. Oh, no, it spawns stone. What does stone have? Blink, defensive matrix, EMP round. He can reveal the cows. Okay, here's the plan. We're going to reveal the cows, and then we can kill them with EMP. I don't even know what's going on. This is awful. <laughs> No, the, it's... Oh, uh, this is so much. <laughs> um... Um... I don't know what, what IDK I've never seen Terminator means, but it just keeps popping up. Something... What is going on? Oh my goodness. Well, there we go. We're going to be unsupply capped. We have so much money that if I can actually get these... No, it killed all my larvae. I think that the battle cruiser just spawned and got exploded. Uh. Oh, Terminator increases the size of the Eradicator, which is why the Eradicator is shooting me from off the map. <laughs> okay. Ace, give me... A fixed cow cost, please. You're going to have to send that to me right now. <laughs> this is... Cows are obviously way too cheap. <laughs> it's, um... <laughs> I can't believe the Eradicator killed me from off the map. It was in its spawn zone. <laughs> uh, that's actually insane. <laughs> that is so lovely. <laughs> Skill issue? I mean, you're probably right. <laughs> I should have gotten good. Um... Ace, please. <laughs> the cows. Do I just have to update the thing on my side? I think I do. It's just, uh... Go to events list. Okay, thank you. Okay, so I need to close the bot. And then I need to go... <laughs> events list. We moo... Unseen. 
I'm upping it to uh, I'm temporarily upping it to a thousand. We can we can reduce it later once we get to a different mission. I apologize, Ace. Could you update the documents? And then I gotta start the bot again. <laughs> Because we do have to eventually, even a thousand people are going to spam it. Yeah, but if people are spamming, th remember, this is a fundraiser. We have been here for about 10 minutes and we raised over $600. <laughs> so if people want to spend a thousand bits multiple times over and over and over, then at that point, Let's uh, let's try this one more time. And if we need Orca sent a pat. Okay. The next step. See if you can order the drone to mutate into a hatchery. I swear. Does anyone want to spawn me something? <laughs> they can attack like the Herc full of Hercs or a hero or something. I need. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. Thank you. Okay, so we got the Herc full of Hercs. We can drop these and then blow up the rocks. <laughs> we can take our expansion. Oh, we've been challenged at Rakshir by Rune. And who did we get? Oh, we got Swan. Oh, no, he can't hit air. There we go. We got the hatchery. <gasps> We're good. Nice Rakshir, bro. <laughs> I think that we're gonna potentially be okay this time. Oh, I have an idea too. This is a spicy one. So, I need to gather minerals, huh? We have an Artanis, and we're gonna get... Oh gosh, that, that boss just keeps getting bigger, huh? Luckily, these guys can clip through. I have Artanis and Artanis as the two heroes that I rolled, which is phenomenal. <laughs> And then we just, we have to be prepared. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grapple everybody over here You're doing well, and then try to hold position them drones. because I have a strategy. Else. Do it then. So well, we're halfway done to harvesting minerals and that's the biggest problem, isn't it? Okay, it's going to work. We're going to get past the tutorial. <laughs> we have so many minerals, we're going to be okay. Uh, and then... We have to morph a spawning pool next, which we got to figure out how to do. And then we're never going to be able to morph Zerglings, are we? No, we'll be able to make a bunch of Overlords. That'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, so we got an Overlord. These rocks are fine. <laughs> it's it's a lot of rocks. Artanis can help blow up the cows with his... Like, <laughs> it's a lot of rocks. <laughs> We got to her. This is exactly where the spawning pool has to be built. There's only one place that it's legal. <laughs> uh, I'm building a lot of overlords because supply blocking. And then. So many. <laughs> so, in order. How do we build a spawning pool? We gotta. We gotta clear a path. For the drone. Set it to build a spawning pool right here. We can move the camera so the rocks stop spawning. Artanis, get over there. And then... Spawning pool, go. Get all these guys out of the way. And we did it! We made a spawning pool! This is... This is the toughest thing I've ever done in any run ever. <laughs> okay, yeah, and you think that you're gonna get me, but... Artanis has vortex. Wait, I can't vortex. Why couldn't I vortex? The spawning pool is finished. What? You should go down to the test chamber. And I was going to put myself in a vortex to save all my stuff. It's broken. Oh no! Well, Artanis and Artanis lived. I don't need money. I just need to figure out how to get some zerglings. I'll make some zerglings. Uh, thank you for the creep tumors. <laughs> and now I guess our zerglings are raptors, which is very kind. Oh, we're supply blocked again. <laughs> We're going to do it. We're going to get through this one together. And Artanis is so strong that it'll be fine. Hey, a Herc survived. Good job, buddy. Impossible. Hybrid. Okay, the hybrid spawned somewhere on the map. And the Rakshir happens somewhere. I'm 
getting guys. And we got Tosh. Hey, how you doing, Tosh? Zerglings are on the way. I don't think that you guys have the ability to kill the eggs fast enough, so we're going to get past it, and then we'll hit a checkpoint. Trivia time. What was the true race of the enigmatic Samir Duran? He was a Zelnaga. What do we get? Plus one ground ranged attack. Nice. Please. Please just open the thing. Oh, no. Why isn't it opening? Now left click on the morph to circling button on the command card. Oh, you know what? It's that stupid bug from Blizzard. They made it so oh, I forgot about this in it is bugged so that raptors and swarmlings don't count as normal zerglings. And someone changed it to raptors. That's actually really unfortunate. We're soft locked and we don't have a way to reset it, do we? We might not be able to do this mission. Oh, press S2. Okay, so we have a uh, we have a way to prevent soft locking. That's good at least, though it got rid of my heroes. Um, this is not the ideal situation for that. There's a cow on my. There we go. Um. I don't have much to work with here, and we hit that- we hit the mission goal, so everything is Goliaths, instead of the regular bot. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well. Why is Brack so weak? Get him, Brack. He's doing his best. Th that is an incredibly well-placed force field. What is this? Tassadar? <laughs> Why are you flying? What's going on, buddy? Why are you here? Hey, Stukov. Okay, we're going to make something happen. I don't know what it is, but we've opened up the map. I'm giving it a quick save. Oh, the Herk Herk activated. But it's at the very end. No, oh, no. So the way that Herk Herk works is that there's 120 seconds for me to grab the Herk. And if I don't get it, then it becomes the enemy's Herk. So we got to try to get over there real quick. Brack sucks, man. Brack needs a buff. Uh, what else do we have? Just some cows over there. Brack is dead. Well, we have Stukov, and he's going to be able to do great. The purifier event of the Stalker appears only once in the purifier attack waves on Cyros. As many cannon questions as that raises is the instigator. Heck yeah. Give me something. 400 killers. I'll take it. Whoa. <laughs> um... Oh gosh, people are spawning, spawning a lot of bosses at the end, huh? Let's, uh... Hello, how are you? <laughs> well, Stukov is very powerful. Hidden on the maps of Zero Hour and Templar's Charge is what strange marine? It is a Tauren marine. I know that one, Stone Zealot. Told her mothership. Flyers can't get out of the main base! Oh no! This is bad. Okay, so we have Stukov. We have, uh... Zeratul, we have Artanis, and we have uh, Kraith from... <laughs> oh, maybe... No, we don't have Blink. We only have Black Hole and Thermal Lance. That sucks. Oh, I was hoping we could get out. Okay, we can make these and start blasting through the enemies as best we can. What are we under attack by? Oh, that's the... That's the objective, isn't it? So we need to move this way. Oh, is the objective going to eliminate me? Whoa. If it eliminates me, I'm going to be very sad if it just targets down all of my buildings. Okay, so the mothership just chills here to protect me. I have, like, Lassar. <laughs> I can't move. Uh, the Herc got under the enemy control, but we took it down. And then... Uh, who are you? Lasara. Lasara doesn't do anything. Why is this Rex your hero? <laughs> oh my goodness. What a bad hero to get. I can't believe that we've raised over a thousand dollars already. What? <laughs> it's, it's mission one. <laughs> it's insane. Okay, so this is the event that spawns battle cruisers and raids, but the enemies are shielded goliaths that were able to take it down because it's hostile to everybody. And then we're going to be able to slowly move forward. My army is not fast, and it's but it's very powerful, I think. 
Unfortunately, all those creeps who actually we did get a nice bite of creep tumors near the end. Ah, oh, this final boss is gonna be insane. Power build. I can't really build much, but I'll use it to make Zerglings real fast. Thank you. And we don't have any detect. Oh, the stone zealots a detector. We actually have mobile detection. This is great. Now we just have to figure out how to kill this eradicator. Oh, these infested Terran are melee for some reason with infested Gauss rifles. <laughs> that doesn't seem right. Oh, maybe someone activated the... Ah, of course, Punch-Out is activated. That makes every unit melee for a bit. Or rather, it gives them minus five range, which is similar. I have no money. So I have to hope that this army is good enough to win the fight. We have Raptorlings, which is good. How strong is this? 4,500 HP? Oh, and they have a bunch of Hercs. Oh, well, um, let's retreat Artanis for a sec. Oh, we actually, okay. I have an idea. We can void prison it. So blink, void prison. Start targeting it down. Kill the ads. The Eradicator's pretty darn scary right now. And then we got to move Zeratul away, I think. Kraith, use your blast. And then you can increase the damage by 15% taken. We're all in melee, and the Eradicator is down. Mission number one completed. Easy. <laughs> you guys got to do better. It only took like 20 minutes. Oh my goodness. Well, that was mission number one.